The Transient Controller is a Plus DSP plugin that lets you reshape the transient and sustain portions of your audio in ways that are impossible with traditional compressors. This is the basic UI of the Transient Controller. The Transient Control itself allows you to increase or decrease the amount of transient, which would be the hit of a drum, the pluck of a bass. The Sustain Control lets you increase or decrease the audio after the transient, and here we have an output gain control and we have an output meter. So I'm going to run a drum loop and let you hear what the transient controller can do. First, I'm going to increase the transient so that you'll hear the snare snap more out of the mix. And I'll turn it back down. Now it's almost like a compressor, but not exactly. We've turned just the transient, or the snap, of the audio down. By clicking on this disclosure button, I can bring up the process meter. This is going to let us see what the processing is doing to our gain. And by clicking on the meter, we can set the gain range of the process meter, whether or not the output gain setting here is included in the processing. And we can save that as a default if we want. I'm going to select include output gain. What I'm going to do now is increase the transient and then gain match using the output gain. So you can see with no adjustment what the output of the transient controller is and then I'm going to match that. And you can see the average level is below center because I've dialed down four and a half dB of gain. And by toggling bypass, I can go back and forth between processed and unprocessed if I want to check the output meter to more closely match the gain of the plugin. By clicking the disclosure button again, I get to the advanced envelope controls. Here we can change the attack and release for the transient section and the sustain section. Normally you wouldn't have to adjust these controls, but sometimes your audio may require it, or you can make adjustments here for special effects. Now I'm going to adjust the sustain. When I decrease the sustain, we're going to get some clipping. While this could be an interesting effect, I don't want that sound in my audio, so I'm going to adjust the envelope controls until the detector works properly. And now increase the transient. So I've really changed the character of that drum loop just by adjusting its transients. And we can do the same thing with a bass. Let me close this transient controller and I have a bass. And let's see what we can do with that. I would like to make this a little bit more round, so I'll decrease the transient.
bring the sustain up a little bit. And increase the output gain so it's closer to the original level. And now I'll bring the drums in as well. And bypass the transient controllers. The Transient Controller is a unique plugin to let you reshape your dynamic audio real time on the fly on the 2D card. So you could use this as a live processor as well as a remix tool, even feed it into a drummer's headphone mix to help accentuate their drums, pop them up out of the bleed in a mix rather than using a gate, and give you a valuable tool to process audio alongside all the other plugins in Plus DSP.